flavoured cotton candy. Well, you know that we've got to try that. <laughs> Hello, and welcome back to the S'mores and Dinosaurs YouTube channel. Now today we're going to do something that we haven't done on the channel for a while. We are going to bring back our series S'more or Ignore. That's right. There's a lot of products out there that claim to have that s'more flavor, and uh, some of them are good. Some of them aren't. So today we're going to try them out. I was shopping for Halloween candy uh, earlier this week, and... Uh, Amongst all the interesting items that I found, including vegetable chipped uh, snack bags for Halloween. Look, parents, I don't know who I need to tell this to. Uh, you're probably not watching this channel. But if you give out garden crisps uh, as your Halloween treat, look, I get it. I like them. And maybe you like them. What the kids want candy. Don't give them vegetables. Give them candy. That's my little PSA. All right. <laughs> now that that's done, when I was searching uh, 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 for candy to hand out, I found cotton candy. Uh, now, I don't know if I would ever give out cotton candy. If I did, I'd be the cool house on the street. It's also like five bucks for like six of these. So I also don't want to be the cool house on the street. <laughs> Uh, but when I was looking, I was like, oh, cotton candy, that's interesting. Until I found out what flavors they were. Now, they have very seasonable flavors here. They have caramel apple. Fun. Cotton candy. Okay. <laughs> but what we're uh, concerned with today is this one right here. The s'mores cotton candy flavor. So, I... Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie, like, when I think of cotton candy, uh, uh, I, I don't really think of a great variety in flavor. Uh, there's pink, and there's blue, <laughs> and, uh, all of these cotton candies today are shades of beige. So, we'll see how good that translates into, and I did not prepare for this. Oh, man, okay. We'll be, we'll be right back. Um, if you're gonna give this out as a treat, you know, you just don't wanna have a container. They, you want the parents to be feel safe, so they put a little plastic seal on that, so I got the most unnecessary knife to open that up. All right, here we go. So, cotton candy, s'mores, cotton candy. Fun sweets, fun sweets. All right, and uh, Huh. So, upon smelling, which you know is always the best, uh, best way to figure this out, it kind of smells like a s'more. It sort of actually smells like a, uh, a s'more candle, which I guess if it smells that way, then it's not a bad thing. It's got a very cotton candy pull to it. Um, let's try this out. Whoa! That's actually good! I always wanted cotton candy as a kid. And it was like one of those maybe once a year's treats. Maybe. Whoa. I was ready to tear this product apart. I mean, besides the box. This isn't bad. It. So your initial, the first taste you get on your tongue 
is chocolate. But as it dissolves, you sort of get the flavors of, you get like a, just a touch of the graham cracker, which of course it's all you really want on a s'more. Because I mean, realistically, the graham cracker is what's holding it together. You need that crunch from the graham cracker to really hold it all to get hold a classic s'more together. Damn! But as it starts to dissolve, you get this subtle, and I don't know how they did it. Obviously, it, I mean, it doesn't look burnt. It looks like cotton candy. But as it begins to dissolve, it releases this subtle flavor of like roasted marshmallow to the point where it's just like, it's not, or it, it, it's not just like marshmallow flavor, but you get that subtle taste of like the smoky residue that comes from a just slightly more than toasted where it's still orange, but you just get that remnants of flavor from the flame. That is amazing. Ah, uh, so I was not expecting this today. Um. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So if I was rating this on a scale of 10 out of 10, this is a gosh darn solid 10. Holy crap. Maybe like, I'd give this like an 11 out of 10. It tastes like s'mores. It somehow ha it captures the s'more flavor. And it's cotton candy. Mm. Just dissolves. And when you're done, you got a s'more container. Cool. Wow. Huh. I mean, I feel sort of obligated to try the other th two flavors on here really quick. Um, let's do that really quick. Eleven out of ten. Twelve out of ten. Would highly recommend this. Unfortunately, the only way you can get this is get the two other crappy flavors. <laughs> so, is this a s'more or ignore? I would say I want some more, please. <laughs> so that brings this episode of S'more or Ignore to a close. I hope you had a great time. I know I did. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to give it a like. You want to watch more content like this? Hit the subscribe button, but hey, only if you feel inclined. And I uh, hope you have a great rest of your day, and I will see you all next time. More of this, please. Mm. More cotton candy, please. Cotton, cotton candy.